you got a satsang this Sunday, everybody's welcome. The website link, it's in the description. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> so, we're all just a bunch of video games running around. This, this is how I see it. It's like no different than the video games that we're playing on. Uh, you see how video games have evolved? Those of you that are, I don't know, 50 and up, used to have uh, <clears throat> in, in television. <laughs> I remember you had a racket. There's just two rackets and a ball. And you hit the ball. And they, and the, that, that, was, that was a big deal. I wish they still had that, actually. I liked it. I like simple, you see? Then they had Atari. Then they had Nintendo. Right now they got what <clears throat> Nintendo three and now they got the PlayStation now they got you know PlayStation four or five now now they got the virtual reality games I'm telling you and now Apple now Apple has the uh, it's like eight grand or something I was doing a consult with the brother he was telling me about it and you put this uh, this thing on and everything that's your computer you just put the thing on and then you move your hands this is how you pick what you want. And, it's just, and he said, uh, he said that he bet that people are going to be walking around. There, at some point, you're just going to see everybody walking down the street with this thing on. You see? This planet, man, the separation, the division is so intense. You got 8 billion people, but like nobody likes each other. Everybody's in their own little world, doing their own thing. They like you if you can help them and all that. But uh, you look around and, yeah, this planet is not for unity. This isn't a unity consciousness planet. No, <clears throat> this is about I got to get mine and I got to survive. And if you're in my way, you know, I got to take care of that. But if you want to help me, okay, we're cool. Yeah, this is thick on this planet. Nobody has time for anybody unless you can help them. So people don't like dealing with people. And so guess guess what guess what uh, <clears throat> the negative dualistic force did? It said, "Look, man, I understand people are stupid. So we're gonna we're gonna give you this technology, so that then you don't have to deal with people. You can just do every just stay online. There's people like that. They just stay online <clears throat> line 24/7. That's what they do. They talk to everybody. They talk. They know they're talking online to them. and never even see them." And then they get miserable and they start going to people's channels and trolling them and, you know, they just become crazy. <clears throat> um, but, and then I remember I played the video game. Uh, oh, but I wanted to finish on this. When Japan comes out, Japan's going to be, be the king of this. When they come out with these sex dolls and stuff, these like real, you know, life looking like robots man there won't be any need i i feel like that's the only only real reason like people get together the sexual instinct's so strong if everybody was asexual geez they nobody would like need each other nobody would probably there'd be no reason to even look at each other anymore the higher beings yeah that's different but there's not many of them they'd recognize you know consciousness They'd recognize their consciousness, they'd see consciousness in another form, and they enjoy that play of consciousness kind of looking at consciousness in another form. Uh, yeah, they enjoy, that's high, that's the purpose. That's the purpose of why we're uh, dressed in these funny outfits that everybody's identified with. I gotta get gains, man. I get, I'm like, everybody's so self-obsessed with their body and, and how they look, and it's like sickening. I'm like, don't you know that, like, um, as time goes on, you're dying every day? If you stay in this planet long enough, you're going to look like a shriveled up prune. Contemplate that, and that can help you be free now. So you don't, you don't obsess so much on this car that we're driving. So the, Japan's going to come out. <laughs> they're going to come out with these robots, though. And um, I just, <laughs> what would be the point? The mainstream... They're done. They're done. Why? They don't need to go through all the all the, the drama and the transformation, the purpose of relationships. They don't have to go through all that now. You got your robot. You just program them to act right. Go see the Stepford Wives. See? That's what the husbands did. They got tired of the wife, like, having her own needs and wants. So he's like, we got to take you to the doctor and fix you. 
doctor's like, yeah, I'm gonna program him to act right. And he did. <laughs> then she likes sex. Normally she didn't wanna have sex. Now she wants to have it and the guy feels good. So this is what the robots are gonna do. Yeah, anyway, it's all good. I made, did I upload it yet? God's running this, this matrix, not, not man, not you. Like who cares? You, it's more motivation to go inside and recognize your, your true source. You and God are a majority. That's your highest relationship. If you get right with that, man, it just doesn't matter what they're all doing. Like, who cares what they're doing? The mind likes that. It wants to focus on the negative. Oh, the world's gonna be so bad and everything's gonna get worse. So let, let it get worse. What difference does it make? You just, you do your time here, you leave, and you're like, oh yeah, that was a big dream. Something has to wake up to that higher level of perception. Otherwise, you're always going to be miserable at like what's happening in the world. I remember the first time I didn't. Ever, I never really liked video games. It would mess my nervous system up. System up. It's, it was too. It was too jarring. I'm too sensitive uh, for that. And uh, but I, I remember they came out with uh, Grand Theft Auto, <laughs> and uh, that was the first time. Like <laughs> that. That was really real. It looked real. You have the people, and they talk. They talk their jive, and and you know, and you shoot them, and uh, yeah. So uh, that's an upgrade compared to the Intel in television, whatever it was called, where the two rackets hitting the ball. Yeah, it's a huge upgrade. So this is what it's like with the people. You have certain people very like their first timers to the planet just graduated from the animal kingdom they're like the intel the rackets it's not intel intelligence it was called intel or something <laughs> it's been like 40 years so i can't remember but they have that software some people have that software they eat they sleep they get married they have sex they work get drunk they die. That's all they do. That's all they're going to do. You can't talk to them. Are you going to talk to them about this non-duality? They'll smile. Yeah, that's nice. They don't understand anything you're saying. So that's, that's that. They're the Intel software. Then you got, <clears throat> so like, like nowadays, I don't know the most sophisticated uh, program out there now for playing games, but whatever that is, you have that. Those are your, those are your high level beings. Actually, the high-level beings are higher than that, but we're doing analogies to, for illustrative purposes. You had that, there's like your Yogananda and your Ram, Ram Krishna and Ram, Ramana Maharshi. I'm making a good video about Ram Krishna. Yeah, that's coming. So you got, they got different software. Well, you have to understand people are limited to their software, to their HTML code. That's all they can do. That's all they can do. This helps you not expect to get rid, rid of these unrealistic expectations. That's why I like the, the analogy I give sometimes when, because somebody, I'll be talking to them and they'll say, you know, they're complaining about, you know, like why, why the people like, they're, like they're, they don't understand what I'm saying. I'm, I'm sick of explaining myself over and over again. And it doesn't even work. They can't understand the subtleties of what I'm saying. I said, I know, but you, you, that's your lesson right there is to not expect that. You do your best to explain and you know that their capacity to understand is already, it's going to be very limited. But then the mind freaks out. Oh, but they have to understand. No, no, God's running the show. Let's see what happens. You did your part. You explained. What else are you going to do? So the analogy, though, was it's like expecting a dog. I mean, it's like the dog can bark, right? Why can't it say hi? Come on, dog. All you got to do is just say hi. That's it. You don't have to say nothing else. Say hi. He doesn't have the software or HTML code to say hi. We know that intuitively. But yet we project that they should know on humans. They can't. They can't. They're limited to the, to the software. That's the video game that like they're playing. That's all they can do. All right? It's like people have different software. <clears throat> Everybody has different software because <laughs> we're all individual. Some people's software, they, uh, it's like, you got to be this religion. If you're not, there's something wrong with you. And then other people have a software like 
church of all religions. Like every, like the essence, like we're all after the same thing. That's a higher software, see? Some people have software totally sense driven, totally <clears throat> identified with achieving material goals and accolades and that's it. That's their software. People have different addictions and stuff. They have the, the software addiction, which again, the law of karma dictates which software you're gonna get. Yeah, this is a real complex thing that we can't get into, but I'm just pointing like that. They have, you know, sex addiction software, coffee addiction software, whatever, alcohol addiction software. We all have this different software. So there must be something though, <coughs> there must be something that realizes that this is all software because we're talking about it right now. This is, this is the highest software did I upload that video yet? I don't know. Uh, is the awakening software? This is the highest software. But you gotta, you gotta go through the evolutionary process, just like we did. Intel, Atari, Nintendo, blah blah blah. You see the evolutionary thing in in video game and software. Same thing. Same thing. The human has to evolve through their software. And then you start letting go of these programs. Then you get upgrades. And then you're on, you're on a different level. And then the awakening software, some, the universe pushes run on that. Uh, oh, well, I need to like find out who, <coughs> what I am and who I am because like this sucks. You, didn't, you weren't thinking that before. Why? Because the software wasn't activated. So don't expect others. Don't get mad at them. Like, cause you see it clear. Well, yeah. Yeah, you see it clear. They don't see it clear. PlayStation doesn't call the Atari retarded because like it's, you know, just doesn't. <laughs> Some of you may say, well, you call people retarded. Yeah, like I, I have fun, but I don't really mean they're retarded. We're all retarded. Different levels of retardation. There, I made balance. All right, so I'll see you Sunday if you want to go to the set zone. Take care.